try this my very first time. Finally, in Tokyo, uh, it's raining here. The weather's probably around, I'd estimate, like 40s and cold. I don't, just got over, you guys know I just got over this weather in California, but it's okay. It's not gonna be like this forever. So we're gonna go get some food or some groceries right now. I'm so hungry, I'm so tired, but I made it. I got through customs, I got, they didn't um, check any of my return stuff, so we're good. Look at the size of these carrots. <laughs> this carrot got the gains. Let's get a car. Let's walk away from the wire that's actually buying stuff. That's one of the biggest struggles. And like, you guys know that I have a really limited diet and I read all labels, but I can't read Japanese. So it's really difficult to like find like food that is suitable. Um, I guess there are translator apps. Like when they contain things like fish or like fish extract it's hard to know sometimes yeah so i'm in like i'm super tired i don't feel like doing anything so we're just gonna get like some food for now all right so i got some of this some of these things again if you guys remember from my last japan vlog egg and then some cucumbers it is so hungry so i'm just gonna eat this now these are little egg things Good morning. So it is this, the second day in Tokyo. Maybe, maybe like the first day. Yesterday I flew in. I slept. It's like the equivalent to, what time is it? I don't even know what time it is in America, but for some reason I'm perfectly adjusted to the sleep schedule, way better than I was to my American sleep schedule. So this morning I got up at like seven something, I'm like, yes, because in America that's like three o'clock. I'm like, okay. So I'm just drinking some coffee and sweet potatoes. They have these, they make these sweet potatoes so good here. You just buy them like warm, like in a bag. I'm like look at this. So good. It is sunny outside now. It was really cold and rainy last night. Guys, I just feel like so much better being here away from Los Angeles. It's weird. I don't know why I felt so stifled there. So like my brain was so cloudy. I felt just un uninspired, unmotivated. I'm hoping traveling like this is gonna like perk me up better. I was just feeling kind of like down and stuff, but I'm feeling refreshed now, so. Best friend from Japan, fancy seeing you here. So I'm gonna go and get a SIM card now. I know, that was, business. That was a joke. Shinjuku now, finding a SIM card, it's the mission. So our selection of SIM cards, 30 days, three mans. <laughs> this is for signing official documents. That's nice. Okay, so I'm back to where I'm staying. So I brought my um, plant protein from Gold's Gym with me because I knew here they're not as like big on vegan stuff and vegan protein especially, so I knew I should bring that. I'm just gonna put some almond milk in this and some water and then drink that and that'll be that'll be it for the, for the day. Still trying to get in my protein. I assume this is almond milk. <laughs> it's really, really hard not be able to read anything. I'm gonna like get a translator app thing, what I'm used to. Uh, wow. Can you guys read that? Can you guys even understand that? All right, I'm gonna drink this. Uh, I'll see you in the morning. Hey, it's day two in Tokyo. Today's mission is to get and to eat 
a primarily vegan vegetarian diet in Japan, which is really difficult because they put fish in everything. So we're heading to, we're in Ikibukura. Is that right? Yeah. Oh, okay. Ikibukura. Ikibukura. And we are looking for a vegan restaurant. So we're here, it's very fancy, it's very different than any restaurant I've ever been in. Okay, so at this restaurant, it is all vegan and there's gluten-free options, but it's super expensive and the portions are probably super small. So we're gonna get something maybe little, but we're definitely not gonna get filled up from being here. What? You do? <laughs> yeah. Alright, well, why'd you get it then? Okay, well, I don't know what this is. I've never had it before, but apparently it's Japanese pudding. Stop! Alright, let's try this. I'm not sure what this is made out of. It's a creme glaze. I don't even know what that is. It's too fancy for my for me. Like, I've never been to such a fancy place. Wow. That's really good. Wait. <laughs> no! Do you have to lick my spoon like that? Taste this though. Yeah. That's it. Mm. I like them both equally. Okay, so that was <laughs> gonna run into people. That was really good, but it was just like tiny portions and we're really hungry and it was too expensive to get actual food there. So we're going to go to this other place. Um, where's it at? Tokyo Station. It's at Tokyo Station and we're going to get vegan oh, ramen now. Tea's Tantan. Tea's Tantan. Specializes in like vegan ramen. Vegan ramen. So you guys have asked for this. Last time I didn't even get a chance to do that, but today is vegan ramen day. So let's go, let's go get it. Maybe the gold sesame. Hmm. All right, so here it is. It's a, it's like a, it's like deep fried or something. Got some vegan meat here, and then this is the what we got. It's this right here. Let's try this. My very first time. I don't know what this is. Yeah, slurp it. Okay. I'm gonna talk a little something. It's too hot to slurp, but it's really, really good. It's so good. <laughs> What's this called again? That's gyoza. But it's vegan gyoza. Go your bowl. All right, this is really good. I'm not used to eating wheat. As you guys know, I don't really do that very much. You like that? Yeah. This means cold, the blue, and this means hot. So you can get hot coffee or any of this like soup and stuff in their vending machines. I just got coffee, just black, because I don't like sugar or cream or no anything sugar. in it. No sugar. The man said no sugar. Yeah, he told me no sugar. <laughs> and so this is this is uh, my pick me up because I'm super um, tired after all those noodles. No legs for you. More legs for me. Oh yeah. <laughs> all right. So this is my little grocery haul. Basically, I got, uh, these are eggs, some grapes, tofu, more eggs. And I got some egg uh, sushi, and I got this because I heard that it was interesting tasting just to try it. 
and then I got my little cucumbers. So. All right, so I'm back now. Got my groceries. I wanted to show you guys what I thought of this uh, Pocari Sweat drink. It's, I guess it's an electrolyte drink, but is it a big thing in Japan? I don't know. Wait. It doesn't taste salty. Are you broken? <laughs> it's not salty at all, it's sweet. No. No, there's no salt. But as I was saying, the fruits and vegetables here are really like ripe and like really good tasting compared to like America. So that's my day. That's what I eat. That's what I ate in a day slash kind of two days in Japan as a vegetarian slash person who wants to get his protein. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. I'll see you in the next one. We'll have more adventures. Um, not staying in Japan for too much longer. I'll be traveling to probably Southeast Asia next. Well, we haven't actually like talked about this yet, but we probably should. Tell us in the comments. Tell us in the comments where Africa, we should go. Africa, Asia. Africa, Asia, Australia. <laughs> All right, guys, I love you very much. Go subscribe to The Masked Man, or not subscribe. Go follow him on Instagram. Please don't. I don't want you there. He just says that, but he's he <laughs> means the opposite. Like he's cool. Ish. Okay, bye guys. I love you very much. Sex to trust real. Ish. <laughs> Why don't you meet me?